This is a very chilling read. This criminal complaint in it. Investigators say Jake Patterson told them that he thought he had gotten away with murder and kidnapping when he wasn't caught within the first two weeks of this tragedy. But because of Jamie's heroic and brave escape late last week, Jake Patterson is behind bars this morning and could spend the rest of his life there. Mr. Patterson, you are charged in count one. Dressed in an orange jail uniform, Jake Patterson sat attentively for his initial court appearance Monday, answering questions matter-of-factly. Yes, sir. The 21-year-old now charged with killing James and Denise Kloss back in October and kidnapping their 13-year-old daughter, Jamie, holding her captive for nearly three months. A disturbing and graphic 12-page criminal complaint released hours before the hearing, alleging Patterson told investigators during his arrest, I did it, later describing how he saw Jamie boarding a school bus on his way to work one day. Saw her and had made the decision at that point that he was going to take her. Patterson allegedly telling authorities he stopped by the Claus home twice to carry out his plan, but got cold feet. On the third try, he stormed in armed with a shotgun. According to the complaint, he shot James Kloss through the door, then found Jamie and her mother, Denise, huddled in a locked bathroom, embraced in a bear hug. Jamie said Patterson told her mom to tape Jamie's mouth before killing Denise, dragging Jamie to his car and putting her in the trunk. Patterson allegedly confessed he only learned Jamie's name after the abduction. The complaint also stating that Patterson made Jamie hide under his bed and stacked totes and laundry bins around the bed with weights, making it easy for him to tell if she tried to escape. These pictures reportedly showing the inside of the remote home where she was held captive. They have not been independently verified by NBC News or authenticated by authorities. Despite alleged threats from Patterson, the 13-year-old worked up the courage to escape last week, wearing Patterson's shoes on the wrong feet, asking a woman walking her dog for help. She said, he killed my parents. I want to go home. Help me. Patterson faces possible life in prison if convicted his father and brother attending the brief hearing. In addition to being supportive of him, his family is very um, heartbroken for Jamie and her, for her family. Um, they have, you know, his dad said to me that his heart hurts for them. Kidnapping while armed. His bill set at $5 million. We're so grateful uh, for Jamie uh, and her safe return. Uh, and now it's time for us to obtain justice for her and for her parents. According to the complaint, Patterson also told investigators he was prepared to have a shootout with police if necessary. Officials two counties north in Douglas County, where Patterson lives, said additional charges could be filed in this case. In the meantime, a judge here in Barron County ordered Patterson back to court on February 6th.